party, friends. No. <laughs> what? <sighs> Didn't think that one through, did I? <clears throat> Hello, my unicorn friends. That works better. Whatever. It's, uh... Turn my phone off. It's Vlogmas Day 17. <laughs> I can't get over that I just called you guys my horny friends. Like, what the fuck was I thinking? <sighs> okay. <laughs> so, uh, from the title, probably, you can tell that I am doing a makeup collab today with Anya from Pink Sweets. And I'm actually really excited about it. Why do these ears look like some cricket? Um, we are doing a makeup look for a holiday party, and we are both going to be using the Blood Sugar Palette. Anya is the queen of these, like, really ornate, colorful eye looks. She's amazing. If you haven't checked her out, you really need to. I, of course, will link her and everything I put on my face down below. So, here is the Blood Sugar Palette. <clears throat> Pinks, purples, reds, orange... Oh, also, I gotta show you guys. I messed up my manicure. First of all, my jewel fell off this one. But look at... It looks like I was in a fire. Uh, no, I just wore some black leggings that I apparently hadn't washed before. So now I have, like, black dye all over my legs and my nails. It was on my... It's Well, you can see it in my knuckles, too. So I'm gonna have to go this week and get new nails because... Yeah, like, look at this one. Like, what? I'm, I'm a little angry at myself about that. <clears throat> Let's do it. <clears throat> what should we use for foundation today? <laughs> Have I used this yet? No. Okay. So I got myself the ColourPop No Filter Stick Concealer. And then I have ColourPop Concealer too, but it's kind of light. Fair 04. I thought I bought another one. I did. Okay. Whew. Yes. Light 12 in concealer and light 40 in foundation. So that's what we're going to do. Well, I'm not sure. This doesn't, this um, cover effects doesn't say if it's silicone based or not. But I did have good luck with the liquid ColourPop foundation and this primer. So I'm just going to kind of smooth that on to where I feel like I have the worst time <laughs> getting things to stick. Which is around my eyes, around my nose, and on my forehead. And my chin. I just edited a small video to put on Facebook of my nephew listening to Baby Shark and doing the little hand gestures and stuff. Now it's stuck in my head. Baby Shark, do 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 do. He's so cute. Uh, my littlest one, the the three year old. He loves it. Apparently, my sister says they do that every morning. They do Baby Shark every morning. Because they have an Alexa, and one of the kids will be like, Alexa, play Baby Shark. There they go. So this is the no co bleh, color pop, no filter sticks. Okay, and, and again, light 40. So today, my friend Brittany is supposed to come over, and we're supposed to do some Christmassy shit. <laughs> Um, we'll probably, I might get her to do some crafty stuff since I know Xavier is not crafty material. <laughs> I loved doing my makeup with Landon yesterday. He is so interested in makeup and stuff. It's, it cracks me up. Ever since I had him do my makeup, I don't know, six months ago or so, he, every time I come over, he asks if we can do makeup and I love it. He's so funny because, like, he's super into cats and stuffed animals. And, like, <laughs> you saw him in the vlog with Elmo, his baby. He, like, takes Elmo to school every day. 
leaves him in the car with my sister. My sister has to take care of Elmo every day. It's his baby. It cracks me up. But he's also, like, super into trains. He likes to wrestle with his brothers. He's, like, everything, and it just it makes me happy. And there we go. Our canvas is prepared. Since it's Christmas, I think I'm going to go with, like, a red and a silver or, like, a red and a white look. Um, there is a really nice white in here called Glucose right here. I think I'm going to use that to kind of set the base. I'm going to attempt to cut crease today. We'll see how that goes. So I'm going to go in with Prick, which is a super beautiful red above my orbital or onto my orbital bone and above my crease Ooh, so pretty <laughs> so pretty that's one thing about Jeffrey's shadows like they are pigmented AF <laughs> and I love it so I got the James Charles palette a little while ago and I've been wanting to use it but like I kind of want to do a dedicated video on it <clears throat> the vlogmas is like been really makeup heavy already so I'm like avoiding it. Like I haven't even taken it out of the package. Like that's how weird I am being about it. <sighs> Who knows? Maybe I'll just give it to the 25th day winner. I don't know. If I'm not going to open it, you know? <laughs> so I've blended and packed on that red shadow. I love it, but I want to deepen it. So I'm going to go in with the color Cherry Soda deepen up the crease a little bit and kind of create a little interest out here. It's not quite as dark as I wanted so I'm gonna go in with blood sugar. I almost went in with the wrong one. I almost said the wrong one. This one just looks a little darker. There we go. That's the contrast I was looking for. Is that dumb? Does that look stupid? I kind of like it, but it kind of looks like a costumey thing. But we're going to keep with it. Because <laughs> that's what I do. Mistakes become fun. Seriously, Baby Shark is like running rampant in my head right now. I can't. So, I should probably bring you guys in a little bit, sorry. So here's where we are so far. We've got prick and blood sugar on our, on our eyes, plus some glucose. I'm like tempted to make this super like costumey and do like candy cane stripes, but like, is that dumb? <laughs> like, is that too much? I don't know. I'm kind of liking it. Let's, I wanted to do a cut crease, so let's try to do a cut crease, okay? I'm going to take this other, sh this lighter shade of ColourPop in Fair. Okay, and I've seen people... I got it in my eyelash. Long eyelash problems. So they do that, right? Like they they put it they put it like here and then they open their eyes really wide, right? Apparently that's where my crease goes that seems really high anybody else anybody else but that is where my that is where it goes when I close my eyes hmm I don't know guys like I feel like an idiot right now I'm just gonna just 
cut the eyelid. To there. Yeah, I think I'm going to do it to there. So I'm going to do it on the other eye too. I'm going to go with this e.l.f. eyeshadow brush. I'm going to go into Candy Floss. And I'm going to put that here. I'm going to put that in the beginning. The middle, the top, the inner, the inner, the inner corner. And then about halfway across. And this is a mess. So I'm hoping it all comes together. Then I'm going to take donor. Pat that on the back. Like, well, not even the back. Just like the middle third, probably. This is uh, very adventurous and uh, different for me. So, don't judge me, monkey. <laughs> then I'm going to take this bigger flat brush and I'm going to go back into blood sugar and kind of pat above. Yes, 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 yes. <sighs> While there's fallout all over my face, I am getting what I want right now. So, I'm taking it and kind of, I'm taking blood sugar and kind of like, going over the top of what I just did. Not, not like, okay, above where I just did. There we go. So we've got the light pink on the inside. We've got the gold and we've got the dark red and some pink. Is this going to be one of those that looks like shit until I like put liner on? So I got the reds and berries eyeshadow <laughs> lips. The liquid lips from Jeffrey. And I love them. And then someone told me that I can use them as or eyeliner. And I was like, yes, queen. <laughs> so we're actually going to take red rum. Perfect for the holidays. How am I going to do this? I think I'm going to take... This liner brush that I got from New Chic. And again, I've never done this. I've never used a Jeffree Star lip as liner. So bear with me. So I'm going to take this red. I go along my upper lash line. Um, I'm not sure about this. <laughs> this is going to be like, Anya's going to be like, why did we do this again? Because uh, I'm crazy and I wanted to try something new and you inspired me. Because like I said, she does these crazy intricate beautiful colored looks and because it's a party look I feel like I can go a little bit crazy and it'll be okay I don't remember how I met Anya now I think someone either in the community or on YouTube suggested her to me and I was like yeah I'll check her out and I just fell in love with her like fun personality you can tell she loves makeup and everything to do with it. And she's been doing Vlogmas too. <clears throat> she's been doing a different makeup look every day. I have an idea. But I gotta get through this part first. Trust me. Can you trust me, guys? Alright. <clears throat> that did not go as smoothly as I had hoped. But there's still hope. 
So, a while ago, I got a silver and a gold Studio Glam liner from Crown. And I think I'm going to add the gold to this one. Oops. So they've got a nice little tip on them. And I am going to... Ooh, ooh, ooh. I actually kind of like that. I'm going to go a little thicker out here with product. This looks crazy. <laughs> like, <laughs> I'm so torn because I like it, but I hate it. I don't know if that even makes sense. I think I'm going to go back in with the darker, the the light, light 12 concealer, and I'm going to try to carve this out a little bit. So I'm going to put some on and get a brush. <clears throat> so I'm going to grab this brush here. This is way more work than I ever put in. But it's the holidays. There we go. If you guys hear my stomach rumbling, sorry. I haven't fed her today. I will come back and fix that. But I like that much more. Much more better. I feel like my sister would be so much better at makeup than I am just because she's like super artistic and she's amazing with things like that but like she ain't got time for this <laughs> she's got three kids she ain't got time for this you got three kids full-time job no she ain't got time for this all right I'm gonna have to go in and like touch some of this up, but I'm liking this a lot better. I feel like I have so much on my eyes right now. Okay, what do we think? I think that looks a lot better. Um, I'm happy with it. I'm going to touch up under my eyes. Should have done my eyes first. And then went in and done my face makeup. Done, done my face makeup, really? Then I should have went in and did my face makeup. Is what I'm trying to say in plain English. Okay, and since I did the gold up here, I think to connect the two, I'm going to try to do the gold on the bottom. Okay, I'm going to let this dry a little bit, but this is what we have going. Gold red beauty okay I did some cleanup the the liquid liner underneath was not working for me it got in my eye so what's left of it after I wiped a bunch of it off with some q-tips I went in with donor and I put it on this flat brush and I just kind of like patted it along so that the gold is still there but it's just built up a little bit and it looks better, I think. I also went in with this Thrive Cosmetics Brilliant Eye Brightener and put that on my waterline. So, I'm gonna go in with mascara now to see if we can't, because right now to me it looks a little flat. So I'm gonna see if I can't pop it up with some of this mascara. I'm gonna use the e.l.f. mascara the length and volume because I feel like I have a lot of control with this brush. I'm going to go to the bottom first. Because also that liquid liner kind of made my lashes kind of stick together. So I want to get in there with this and kind of break them up. 
but I don't want to get mascara all over my face. Keep in mind, I'm not saying this is an everyday look, okay? This is a holiday party look where you want to look fab and be as bright as the tree. At least that's what I'm going for. I kind of figured out yesterday at my fan, not figured out, but like it was reiterated that I am kind of the black sheep and the most unique, like, and I say unique in a way that my family kind of calls me the freak of the family. I don't know. I'm like outspoken and kind of live differently than the rest of them. Actually, that's not too bad. And I called my uncle a weirdo today or something. I called it. No, I think I called him a freak. Um, cause literally there's a picture of my mom, my grandma, and my three aunts, and my uncle's in the middle. He is head and shoulders, literally head and shoulders above them. Like none of their heads come above like here on him. I don't know where the hell he got that. Like I, I really don't. My grandpa wasn't very tall. Oh my, I guess my uncle Wayne was pretty tall. My uncle Cease was semi tall, but. I don't remember my grandpa being that tall. So I don't know where he got all this tallness from. Yes! That mascara pulled it together. <sighs> Sometimes mascara and liner can, like, save a look for real. If I wasn't being such a butthead right now, I'd probably try to do fake lashes. But I spent so much time on this eye look that I don't want to hide it behind some flashy lashes. Okay, I'm gonna grab... I'm gonna grab a spoolie and just kinda clean up any clumps. There we go. All right, I'm happy with that eye look now, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. <laughs> so we've got the gold here, the gold there, the two or three colors on the eyelid. The problem with having such hooded eyes, though, is that, like, unless I'm doing this all night, y'all can't see it. That's why I have to kind of go out and up because my hooded eyes like hide everything. So now that we have taken 14 hours to do that, no, it's been an hour. It's 2.03. It's been an hour. Can we finish my face now? Can we please? <laughs> Man. I don't know why I just yelled for my mom. That's that was stupid. I'm gonna grab these BH Cosmetics blush and contour palette, and we're just gonna warm up my face. <laughs> oh, that was something that I wanted to talk to you guys about. Is that the other day in a video I asked, you know, what's the difference between bronzer and contour? Bronzer is a warmer shade meant to warm up the face, give you a little bit of color, and contour, I guess, is more of a gray shade, and it's used to define and make shadow right here. So it's, it's meant to, it's meant to make this, uh, where you put it, it's meant to make it sink in. And then when you do highlight, it's made to make it stick out. Does that make sense? I hope so. I like to put dark in my hairline to just kind of, I don't know, make it look better. Uh, Jaclyn Hill does the same thing. She'll either use contour or uh, eyeshadow. <laughs> I saw in one video that she had done eyeshadow up in her hairline and then it got all over her hand because she forgot about it. So, 
It was, it was, it was per cute, per cute for Jacqueline. So since we're doing Jeffree Star, we might as well go into the 24 karat gold palette. I'm actually going to go in with Legendary. Maybe a little bit of Giza. I'm going to take a flat, flat brush, go into Liberace, which is this gold shade. And I'm going to highlight up here. Kind of bring together that gold and red look. Did I just fuck this up? Did I fuck this up? Why does it feel like there's so much more eye space over here? No, I think that actually looks nice. Okay. And finally, lipstick. We're going to go back in with red rum since we've got it on our eyes. Okay, guys. There is the face look. The face look. It's a total facial. All right. So there's my party look. I honestly wish I'd had time to do this yesterday before I went to my company party because I think it would have looked great with that outfit I had on. But here's what we have. We've got that gold liner. We've got Blood Sugar Palette, Jeffree Star. We've got Jeffree Star Highlighter, Jeffree Star Lipstick, Jeffree Star Eyeliner, which is the same as the lipstick. I don't know how to do beauty. Like, how do those beauty gurus do it? There's like... I look so sad, but look at my makeup. It's so pretty. Oh, I'm not allowed to smile, but look at my eyeshadow. I don't know. <laughs> Is this how you do it? Anyway, that's what I came up with from the Blood Sugar Palette by Jeffree Star. I'm pretty excited. I'm pr pr pretty excited. Pr pretty excited. Head on over to Anya's channel and see what she came up with, which I'm sure is a lot better than this. <laughs> but, like, the more I look at it, the less I hate it. So, I just got a text from my friend Brittany. She's going to shower and head over here. So, we're just, I hopefully we're going to have fun. I, I, I need to show you guys this mess that I've made while doing this video. It's a disaster! I, I can't. I, I can't adult right now. So I'm actually going to wash this off and go take a shower. And this, my friends, is how you clean makeup off. This stuff is seriously green clean by pharmacy. So good. I'm going to go in the shower, rinse this off, and it'll all be gone. All of it. And you saw how much makeup I had on. Say whatever you want because I know how to edit. <laughs> okay, cool. <laughs> Hello. I need to borrow Welcome your. Back to the <laughs> Welcome, my horny friends. <laughs> <laughs> Brit's here. We'll be hanging Hi. out. <laughs> We're gonna try ugly sweater cookies. We're just I'm introducing her to Love Actually, which is one of my favorite movies. So, so good. <laughs> so I got this at Trader Joe's. I think it was like maybe ten bucks. <coughs> Sorry. It's got chocolate and vanilla cookies in it. You want to be chocolate or vanilla? Mm, chocolate, 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 chocolate. Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure they have the same things in them. And then it comes with red, green, and white, which for the royal icing, we have to kind of play with it for a couple minutes. So probably what we're going to do is we're just going to sit here, watch Love Actually, and do the cookies. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And if there's anything fun, I'll like edit it in. <laughs> Easy peasy. Heads up, there's a bonus Hawaiian shirt. Bonus. Bonus. Looking forward to that. Do you bone in the bonus shirt? As long as it's like unbuttoned and flapping. <laughs> like my legs. Just enjoy. <laughs> I'm scared I'm gonna like pop this. Bit. I know. White frost. Well, I mean, well I, you know. <laughs> 
for my horny friends. <laughs> Now I've got baby shark stuck in my head again. <laughs> precious. So precious. <laughs> I had to show her the video of Leo. Because she hasn't looked at Facebook today. Okay. <laughs> okay. It's a party. <laughs> that was fun. It's green. Maybe it is colored by lettuce. I don't know. Totes. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> that's all the bad romaine in it. <laughs> I kind of think that's the direction I should go since... You should do horror Christmas. Yeah, since that's my jam. It is. Not horror Christmas. Horror. I had mac and cheese at my company party last night. It was Gouda mac and cheese. And then they put blackened steak on top of it. That sounds so good. I orgasmed at the table like five times. For real. <laughs> so good. <Gouda. laughs> I was drooling out of all lips. Oh. <laughs> Fucking hate us. <laughs> oh, We're the worstest. <laughs> but also the bestest. Better than all the restest. <laughs> So Liam Neeson would be the dad that shows you Titanic and you talk about Titanic, but then he also threatens to murder someone if they don't return you. Yeah. I mean, it's the best of both worlds. Yeah. I swore my heart would never mend. I just want to love you, baby. <laughs> All right, so I got Brit these really cool, like, um, what's it called? Nightmare Before Christmas? How come I can't remember that? <laughs> so I got her these stemless wine glass type things. So I'm going to make us drink. <clears throat> so we're going to take this <laughs> mojito mix that we got in California. Now, there's no ice in here, but everything's cold. It's like straight out of the freezer in the fridge, so... Lime Malibu rum. I know you like Malibu. I do. <laughs> <laughs> and then just Sierra Mist. There we go. Cheers to mojitos. Cheers. Make this season scary and bright. Cheers. Cheers. Ooh, those That's are nice. refreshing. <laughs> I love a mojito. We'll show our cookies now and then we'll finish the movie. <laughs> Alright, I'll show mine first. Because okay. I'm right here. So we've got this pretty red sweater. With all sorts of ornaments on it. This is a big fuzzy green sweater for the hose. Dem hose. <laughs> Dem hose. This is my Hawaiian short, which was super simple. I just, you know. That's my sweater vest that my third grade teacher wore, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> and then this white and green one. You want to show them yours? Sure, let's do this. Okay, let's start with my faves. Oh yeah, your fave. This is my Freddy Krueger. Yep. <laughs> Don't mind the sound effects. Britt's a big horror fan. Mm hmm It's my only tattoo. Then I got these ones there. What's up, pretty snowman? What's the snowman? And then I've got my sweater vest with the snowman coming out of the sweater, uterus. Sweater, sweater. Don't mind that. 
It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> And then I've got this with a whole bunch of shenanigans on it. <laughs> so fun. <laughs> and then the Hawaiian shirt. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it just sort of happened. It's awesome. <laughs> you probably won't see a lot of us like actually decorating the cookies because we sat here for like two hours and did it. <laughs> like, Silence. We didn't say much. <laughs> we just what kinda... we did say was... Not a lot of probes. That's how we roll. <laughs> but you've you've got a lot of video from this morning because Lord knows I messed up that facial makeup a lot. <laughs> All right, uh, we're gonna go. I will see you guys before the night's over because I still got to do advent calendars for the night. But we're gonna enjoy the, a drink and watch the end of this movie and probably another one. <laughs> All right, guys, it is. After nine, I want to be editing soon, so I want to go through and do the advent calendars real quick. My girl Brittany just left. We didn't make it through the second movie because I gotta edit. She knows that. <laughs> She's so understanding. So, our Harry Potter figure is Professor Lupin. You can see his scars. He's so dapper. I just love him. Let's put him with everyone else. Stay. When we've opened all of these, I will set them up all together and we can, you know, kind of go over all of them. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> Let's go with our winner for the day, 17. Deanna Anderson. Congratulations, Deanna. I will be messaging you. Now let's see what you're going to get from the makeup calendars. Hello? Sorry guys, my phone died while I was out there, so it must be back on because I plugged it in. Alright. Are we on day five? here. Yes, day five. A shimmer blush. No name for it. Um, I wouldn't wear this as a blush. I would wear this as an eyeshadow because I don't like that much like shimmer on my cheeks. But to each their own. <clears throat> if Deanna wants to wear it on her cheeks, on her eyes, on her nose, it's all up to her. <laughs> all right, day 17 for Makeup Revolution. It's a tubey tube tube. And this is a lip gloss in the color Soul. It's a really nice pink lip gloss. That's a good one to go. Actually, those colors go together nicely. So let's see what's in the NYX. And maybe they'll all match together. Could you imagine? Oh, matchy, matchy, matchy. They kind of do. <laughs> so funny. So this is a NYX lingerie in slip. It's a really nice pink nude. So these all kind of color coordinate together. So Deanna, congratulations. Yay. That's the day. That's the end of day 17. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this. And go check out Anya. I'm like dropping things everywhere. <clears throat> Stay. Go check out Anya's channel and see what she came up with for her holiday look with the blood sugar palette and i will see you guys tomorrow for day 18. i love you guys mm -hmm.